Metal Gear Solid V The Phantom Pain is a science fiction video game that follows the exploits of Venom Snake, a widely renowned soldier who finds himself drawn into the machinations of the mysterious terrorist organization Cypher. Wouldn't you agree? <laughs> we both are demons. Our humanity won't return. You, me, we've no place to run. Nowhere to hide. And that is why I'll show you my demon. During a series of missions across the Angola Zaire border region, Snake stumbles upon several blood diamond operations run by the local militias, who are using kidnapped children as both soldiers and forced labor. Their lives for a fistful of diamonds, huh? And what happens after that? They can't go home. They've only got two options. Heaven or hell. No, there's another. Taking pity on the captive children, Snake decides to free and spirit them away to his organization's headquarters and attempts to help them reintegrate into society. You probably noticed on the way in, we've expanded housing. They'll have their own quarters, separate from ours. Won't be counted as staff. So what, we're running a daycare now? To learn how to read and write. Do basic jobs. A chance at a real life. Just not from behind a gun. Being behind a gun's what we do, boss. There's no room for angels in our heaven. However, several of the children see Snake's efforts as a means to control them, which prompts their ringleader, Eli, to unleash a deadly virus to rebel against his new perceived captors. They've spread the parasite across the island. It won't affect you if your voice hasn't broken, so they're safe, for now. Eli's driven all the adults off the island. Recess is officially in session. His own version of Lord of the Flies, only instead of a pig's head, Sahelanthropus. And it's swarming with something worse than flies. Thus, despite the best efforts of Snake and his comrades, Eli and his followers are unable to escape the traumas of their past, which causes them to fall back on their more violent instincts. The plight of the child soldiers in the Phantom Pain reflects a dark reality in war-torn zones across Africa and the Middle East, where extremist movements recruit or kidnap vulnerable children to fuel their causes. More than 357 million children live in war and conflict zones today, and tens of thousands of children are being used as soldiers. They become fighters, suicide bombers, human shields, messengers, spies, and they are even used for sex. They experience violence to the core, either as witnesses, victims, or active players. Organizations like the UN Office for Children in Armed Conflicts and other human rights groups work diligently to prevent the exploitation of children in these grisly conflicts and shield them from the true horrors of war.